why should local government planners and other related professionals join the Gentle Density Network? First, we want to tell you a bit about Small Housing BC. Small Housing is an organization that's been around for a bit over a decade now, and we work on research, advocacy, we do municipal partnerships, offer all kinds of technical advisory supports. Small Housing catalyzes the evolution of single detached neighborhoods to provide ground-oriented homes equitable for all. Small Housing BC has been working long and hard, but we're getting excited because there seems to be a positive response at all government levels. What we're advocating for is more diversity of home types to really complement the existing homes and the existing families and households that are in our neighborhoods already, so that we can have more options and more housing diversity that can fit all the needs of our residents and our communities. Gentle density encourages a variety of house types to be permitted in our neighborhoods, such as laneway and coach homes, duplexes, triplexes and multiplexes, infill row houses and secondary suites. Supporting the evolution of our single detached neighborhoods can be daunting. So we've created a space where local government planners and related professionals can tackle these collective challenges together. We are accommodating a lot of growth and we're seeing a lot of influx of school-aged children, families, and so lots of interest in family-oriented development. We're really exploring ground-oriented options. Interested to see if there's more we could do to diversify housing choices in our single detached neighborhoods. There are a lot of things that are being used in different places and it's great to get a chance to talk to people about what works, what doesn't work, and what strategies can help make those different housing forms more useful in their communities. It is an opportunity for planners across the province to come together to share ideas, to share their experiences of working in their own jurisdictions and trying to promote gentle density. Otherwise, we'd just be people working on their own and here we're bringing people together province-wide to really have a genuine exchange of ideas. I mean, it really excites me the fact that all sorts of municipalities in all types of sizes and with the different context that they each has are exploring ways to support diverse and innovative ways to accommodate the housing needs of each of their communities. It does bring together experts from across North America and that coming in to really showing not only the ideas, but then how they're expressed how they're actually built. We're all working in our little silos trying to do largely the same things and of course we have all our different contexts in terms of site sizes and slopes and constraints but I think there's a lot that we can learn from each other so I'm, I'm really happy to hear about the work that small housing is doing. The Gentle Density Network provides opportunities to collaborate with other local government planners and related professionals to participate in working sessions, webinars and in-person events and learn about new resources, including a web tool for easy information access. Now is the time for us to collaborate and enable gentle density across communities and in all neighborhoods. We want to have you at the table, so join your fellow planners and related professionals in making the change we're all striving for.